series. A little bit slow in taking off uh, all around, in fact, both Fletcher and the mid on fielder. Ah! And Malcolm gives him out, so he strikes with his first delivery. Abdul Rahman, the left arm spinner. Norman Malcolm agrees with uh, the appeal and sends Lindell Simmons on his way. And uh, lofted over the top by Simmons. Good confident shot for a boundary. Just uh, in the area which is perfect for that shot. He played it well. There he goes again. That'll carry all the way. That's a big one from Simmons. Not many people in yet, but it's got them going. A four and a six of the first two balls of over number three. Raman. Down the wicket, absolutely straight and back overhead. Fine blow by Simmons. Lovely use of the feet. Got there, under it. Perfect straight hit. What? Well, he's hit that hard and hit it through the covers. Went back. Slow pitch. Timed it well. Yeah, but there's no one out there it's going to land safely and that's what he gets for bold tactics top edge carries for four five overs gone 37 for one I'm not sure whether Darren Bravo intended to hit it in that direction it's a slowish outfield and I think that has crossed the boundary it's gone away for four Could be another boundary, consecutive boundaries to end the over. Six overs gone. It's uh, 47 for one. Carries well over the boundary from Darren Bravo. Another boundary on demand for the West Indies. All the way for six. Hit very hard by Simmons. Boundary to end the over. Eight overs gone. 64 for one. Wow, some really good striking of the ball. This partnership, very impressive. 66 so far from 42 balls between Simmons and Bravo. He's quite enjoyed the improvisation from West Indies today, especially this man. But it's been good. Goes for the cut shot, lashes that one. Pass point for four. This is magnificent batting from Simmons. Offside. This time it's the left-hander who cracks one, past the field for four. That's even better, that's gone the distance. Mighty six, magnificent strike from Bravo. Elegance personified, that really was a huge hit. Well, a wicket has fallen though, so I'm going to have to hand it back up. We'll come right back to you. Well, this is uh, a tremendous strike from Abdul Rahman just when Pakistan... Ball! Quicker finds the gap. This is lovely batting from him. The ball will once again win the race. Exquisite timing from Lendl Simmons. Caribbean culture. And as Caribbean Ball! people, when we have music, when we have drums, it's all... Well, let, let's go back upstairs, another wicket has fallen. Oh! This one gets past Wahabria asked for four. Quicker one from Abdul Rahman, it wasn't really required. Just as Samuels had come in. Yeah! It's in the air, it's wide of the fielder, and it's gone over the ropes. Well struck, he's a good striker of the ball, Is done to hurt. He's gone. Way down the pitch, uh, Marlon Samuels. He's gone through a, a difficult period trying to relieve himself and just missing the ball. A comfortable stumping chance for four. And a big appeal for caught behind the wicket and given. So the West Indies just uh, losing their way here. Hyatt getting a little edge onto that. That's a higher. And it's gone higher and higher and higher and then comes down to earth over the ropes 
in the air, a catch for long on, taken. In the air, it's going to be a catch as well out in the deep, swirling and taken. So Russell goes, the West Indies lose their seventh wicket. Straight back down the ground and that's four. So the first body space, he's banged it past the bowler. And what a lovely shot down the ground. Not quite going all the way, they'll come back for a second. Just eased on it. In totals and the runs on the board. That's to hand and it's taken. Ashley Nurse takes his first catch in international cricket. But nicely stroked through the covers on the up. It's going to be a foot race which the fielder will lose. Nice shot Russell drifting on to Midland leg, leg stump, and the ball wins the race again. Helped nicely, helped for another boundary, consecutive boundaries there for Shazad. Should be out, is out, taken back of the length, Woods for Ravi Rampal. Second Pakistan wicket goes down, and all smiles for the men in maroon and yellow of bowlers just passed a Fletcher a little bit of movement off the seam but uh, too much bat on the fortuitous edge previous matches that is a meaty blow that has traveled all the way for six what a way to end the over through the gap and a no ball as well a little bit in discipline now coming into the West Indies Second no ball, second free hit. Hit it down, that's a, a part of the outfield which is faster than uh, most of the rest. The issue it is, and it just uh, seems to have touched a rope. Easy. In the air, and beautifully taken. Very, very well taken. Dropping short. Danza Hayat comes in, gets his fingers onto the ball, it's dying on him. Isbah has a good average in this form of the game, over 37. Now what's going on here? The bales are being removed, and I think Fletcher is pointing out to the umpire, Norman Malcolm, about hit wicket now will Malcolm ask for the third umpire to have a look at it he's over at square leg Let's see that right foot goes back there you go and I think it wasn't his foot I don't think he stepped on it I think it could have been his body that took it off just there ah uh, there it is his heel Tis, uh vision was with the ball gives him out now so four down important wicket misbah clever shot reverse sweep will go all the way Bishu won't get there very clever shot for Muma going to be difficult for Pakistan it's flown past the man at point Freddy's a dangerous customer we've known that for years but how long how deep into the innings he can carry this sort of aggression, time will tell. Brilliantly caught by Darren Sammy. That was traveling. But the timing of the jump was good. And more importantly, it has stuck and that is the end of a freedom. That's hit out. He misses the field. That smash. I think that's gone flat for six, has it? Oh, that could be gone. That is gone, is it? Well, Sammy thinks so. 
Meanwhile, the ball has gone towards the boundary, but uh, the West Indies captain feels that he has his man. Russell dived out of the way, or did he just tumble over? Hit the stumps, the bat batsman is shot at the crease. This is fantastic cricket from West Indies. They've been outstanding in the field. There'll be a loud cheer because uh, that is incorrect. The wrong button has been pressed and there'll be a loud cheer now. There was a moan before. It should just be the last word of the first two. And they've pressed the incorrect button again. Well, I think we need to get someone to the third and fast box to explain which button to press. Don't worry, it'll be rectified, Darren Sammy. third umpire has set out, the standing umpire says out, <laughs> and the scoreboard now says out. <laughs> so we can count the dramas on, of just one ball, four, I can tell you folks. Target was, uh, was not timed, and that's gone straight over the bowler's head for four. And uh, into the air, down towards the boundary and taken now will this count as a dismissal yes it will because the previous snowball was not for overstepping the crease in tense situations and picks up another one cleans up up the reman he's got four now outstanding effort from a lick spinner in now someone will take this catch it's comfortable well, it should have been more comfortable than that. Sammy eventually takes it. <laughs> Bishu was in his view. But I think Bishu realized that this fellow is a lot bigger than I am. I better get out of the way. Well, that's a bad bounce. And uh, where do you can blame the chink bug? In the air, over the top, down to the boundary, four more. West Indies win. West Indies win. Darren Sami, elated.